Oh my god, this video was so long to film and I feel so exhausted. But that's also because I've been blowing my nose all day because I think I'm going out with a slight cold. Yay! Hello, I'm Starbot and welcome to the world! Woo! And in today's video, I decided to kind of do like a wardrobe clear up because I saw that Freddie My Love has done this and I know that YouTube recently has been going crazy for decluttering like Rachel Love has been doing this, Tati has been doing this, Emma Rattangle has been doing this, so does Nails has been doing this and I was like, why don't I do my own take on it and do a wardrobe clear up or a wardrobe purge or a wardrobe decluttering and I kind of mainly focus on the clothes this time but if you want me to do stuff like accessories or shoes or anything like that, just comment down for the next bunch and before we start I want you all guys to subscribe to this channel because we have got some really exciting content coming up so without further ado if you're ready to see all the juice and the gossip behind my clothes including what I'm wearing let's begin welcome to my wardrobe you like how I color coded ha 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 so basically if you see my room pause basically you know that it's directly next to a window yeah I don't know it's not relevant but for this video we're gonna do this in a system so anything that goes back in here I'm keeping anything that goes in this chair which is right next to me I'm gonna try on it. and anything that just goes on the floor, I'm not keeping it anymore. Like, I don't even like it, but I'm more likely to try everything that I don't know about on because I just felt like clearing out, so why the heck not? So let's begin. So we have, oh, these trousers. They are so comfortable. These are so loose and flowy. These are actually women's trousers. I think my older sister Mon said that these didn't fit her, or she didn't want these anymore. So then I took them, and honestly, they're like the most comfiest things ever. I'm gonna keep these, but I just need to remember to wear these more often. Then we've got, okay, obviously, I'm not getting rid of these anytime soon. These are just too lovely. Then, oh, oh my god, my literal wardrobe staple is my navy blue chinos from Zara. Literally, I wear these so much. I'm not kidding you, I, I literally wear these with practically everything because they just go with everything. Literally, navy is my black. Don't fight me on this. Obviously, I'm gonna keep my best fitting River Island jeans. Oh, <gasps> I'm sorry, but these trousers just need a mention because these are actually like pajamas. They are so soft and the quality of these is amazing. They came from ASOS and I really, really like these a lot. And I definitely wanna get more like funky suit trousers, maybe from like ASOS. Comment down below any stores you think, but oh my God, I love these to death. These are definitely key. My Zara jeans I'm keeping. I'm gonna try on these. These are my River Island super skinny jeans, which I mean, I'm not all these in a hot minute. I'm definitely gonna try these on. So, Sorry, but, oh, you can see my pocket. So, firstly, these fit so freaking well around the waist. What the heck? These make me look like yeah, my butt's fit. God. Look how long the pockets are. Look, they're like halfway through my butt. Then my pies don't look like I've got a butt, okay, people? They just make it look really flat. Where's my butt? The part of the butt area. These were a struggle to put on. This outfit is reminding me of old stuff, which I definitely want to remove. I just don't wear these anymore. I mean, I love the fit because it's like old skinnies and I used to love old skinnies. I just don't like these anymore. I think I'm going to give these away because I just don't wear them anymore. The last time I wore these were in the snow and that was in December. And the time before that was like, I think ages ago. So these definitely need to go away and I definitely need to get a lighter pair of jeans. <gasps> the these. I'm sorry, we cannot forget about these statement trousers. These are everything. Of this. Mmm. Oh, I don't know about these. These are also from ASOS, but they just feel like aren't the nicest quality. Like, on camera, they kind of look freaking gorgeous, but like, I don't know. I'm, I think I'm gonna try these on because I always get mixed. Like, every time I wear them, I'm like, oh, they're decent, but I just don't know. I'm gonna try these on. Okay, so now we've got my little pink trunk. These actually feel so comfortable. I forgot about the comfort of these, but like, they're really comfortable. The color is really nice. It actually kind of matches my bed. And the fit, like, I'm looking at the fit from the viewfinder, which is very tiny, by the way. They fit really nicely. Damn, they actually fit quite nice. The only problem is, if you look at the waist, there is so much gap on the waist, and I'm like, why? So the only problem is I have to worry about. Every time I put these trousers on, I'm like, actually, yeah, let's keep these. These I'm 100% keeping until I find another pair, but these are way too comfortable. Throw away. They're super comfortable. Got loads of compliments on these. Ah, and another piece I want to try on. Oh, Jesus, three trousers. Wow. I want to try these on because, I mean, I love these to death. I know they're everywhere at the moment, but the only problem with these are they're just a bit too tight and round the, is it the top? Is it around the top? Top of the leg or the bottom of the leg? I always forget the names, either calf or thigh. I definitely want to try these on because, I don't know, I just want to see how the fit is again. Okay. Oh my god, you can see my definition. These trousers are uncomfortable. Oh, oh, I can't move. Oh my god. Oh, I'm not exaggerating to you how uncomfortable this is. I mean, they're nice. I love the print. But I feel like they make my legs look bigger. And my legs aren't very big. They're okay. I'm not in love with these. I definitely want to find another piece of these. But at this very moment in time, these are a big fat. No, they're so uncomfortable and stiff. And I'm 
just like don't want to be wearing these. I try to avoid these because that's how uncomfortable they are. So these are out. And obviously keep in mind white trousers. We're going from trousers into shirts. Guys, this is my first vintage designer piece. I found this in like my non nose closet. And oh my gosh, I was so surprised. Why? You know why I'm saying closet? It's wardrobe. We live in London. It's Machino. I was so surprised. This is a bit big though, but I know I can make this work. This is an instant key. Oh, I'm obviously keeping my white Zara shirt with the flower embroidery. I wore this the other day actually. I just don't know because like it's nice but I just think it's very stiff and prim and I'm like Ugh. no oh oh my god this is a nut oh like although it really suits me the color I just oh I hate how like strict it is oh I used to love this again but I have again like I have another white shirt which I love and I just don't feel like this is me anymore I just feel like this is like prim and proper stuff and I'm like now really florally stuff but this is not me anymore so I'm getting rid of this then we've got obviously gonna keep this little a funky number. I'm definitely gonna keep a plain white shirt. Keep always a plain white short sleeve shirt. Literally the best essential you ever need. Obviously gonna keep your smart shirt. Face the nemesis of the really thin. I love it, but at the same time it's really thin and sheer. So I don't know. I'm a bit like, uh. I mean, this isn't the worst. Oh my god, what the heck. Uh, I mean, it isn't the worst. It doesn't feel uncomfortable. It actually feels really nice on the body. The print's nice. I feel like the problem is you can see my nipple. Hello, nipple. And I just I really don't wear stuff like this anymore, which really upsets me because I used to love this. I used to adore this. And I used to wear it with these really, really tight skinny jeans like I had from River Island that were so tight. It would like suffocate my leg and I'm like, nope. So I think because I don't wear this enough at all actually, I've never gravitated towards this. I'm not going to keep this, which really breaks my heart again. But no, I don't think I'm going to keep this. Next, obviously, I'm going to keep my little prime up love or saver. <gasps> oh, why is it full of dust? Oh, the t-shirt is so nice. It's from American Eagle. And this was like one of the first ever pieces that I found that fit me like round the arm. And I was so happy that I didn't have to buy a medium. Bella. Break good times, come on. I really, really like this though. And I need to wear it more. This is my top man candy. I call it like a candy cane because it literally looks like one of those like, people who work at a candy shop. I'll take it to the candy shop. I, I just, I'm like, I like it. I don't know how to work it, but I just feel like it's stiff again and really prim and proper. I don't like the material. Oh my God, this is a big fat no. This is a big fat no. Fine, I'm not going to deny it to you. It fits nice around here, but. This does not feel comfortable when you lift your arms up. Also, it does look really prim and proper, even if I do this. I don't know, I just really do not like this anymore. I mean, it breaks my heart because I love this shirt, and I remember I got this rude. But seriously, like, no, I don't want to keep this anymore. Buy a pink shirt. Oh, bowler shirt. Especially these, these ones from Zara are just such nice quality and so flowy. They're so nice. I always get scared about wearing them, though, because I always constantly want to wear them, but I'm always scared in case these get, like, ruined, so I need to wear these more often, definitely. I'm keeping this one. Now, this is so loose and flowy, and the colour is ever it's just really comfortable, and I love it. This is a key. My throw between one jump is a key. Obviously, my little red Hawaiian print is gonna be a key. Cheese is that colour on camera. Then we got mm, uh, This is from Gap and it was in the outlet center. I mean, I like it. Yeah, mm, 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 mm. I like it, but I don't know. I'm a bit like, I don't know. I'm gonna try this one on. I mean, this is not too bad. Like, I think the fit is brilliantly. Actually, this isn't actually bad at all. I actually kind of like it again. Oh my god, I forgot how much I like this. Oh my god, it's so comfortable. This is such a comfortable piece. The problem is, my friend Lauren will end up going, Where's Wally? But seriously, this is actually quite a nice piece. Ah, I like it. I really do. So, this is a definite key. Shirt from weekday is actually everything. I do not care. It's amazing. Love this embroidery. I wish you want to buy another one from weekday. My Zara shirt, I'm obviously going to keep. This is the first shirt that I got into Hawaiian shirts into. And now I'm basically in a love relationship. Love this. This is the shirt that represents me. And then another American Eagle shirt. This actually kind of reminds me of one I used to wear when I was younger. It's quite nostalgic for me. Like a little bit. It came from my Zara kids and I love it. I still love this one from American Eagle. It's so nice. I love American Eagle because they're just, they just feel so good. Your body. So this is a definite key. I didn't try this on because I actually forgot how it fit. Is it from Massimo Dutti? I need to try it on again. It's not as prim as I think it is, but I just want to try it on again for the sake of it. Oh yeah, nope. I'm keeping it. But this is so nice. I feel like if you unbutton it like a little bit more sexy. It just looks really cool. And I love how like this is the one shirt that I don't mind that it wants to come back together. Because I just think it looks really nice. And I like the grand neck color a lot. The sleeve length is good. And the nice thing is that you can roll it up. The other problem is I feel like it's just a bit of a stiff material, which is a bit like uh but I don't mind it for this because I feel like it makes the look a lot more smarter and my kind of vibe and I really love it. I love the print. This is a definite like I'm already gonna keep this anyway, but I love it. Try on this because I don't wear stuff like this anymore. 
anymore, like really thin jumpers. I used to love these actually. Like I used to wear this all the time. Okay, now we have this, which I'm kind of mixed on because firstly, it feels amazing. And secondly, it fits great. And I love the color because it's so loose and like comfortable. It's like one of those pieces I just want to swell around in. The other problem is you can see my nipples. What? I can see them through the viewfinder. What the heck? I understand this is supposed to be like a summer jumper, but not a nipple exposure. Because I don't think I'll ever wear this because it's really too thin to wear, like at any time of the year. So I'm kind of more leaning towards a no for this, which will protect me because I used to love this, but I, I'm gonna say no because I don't picture myself wearing this anytime soon. Then, <gasps> keeping you, I wore you recently. I think I wore you to school actually. See, I'm extra at school. Keeping you, keeping you. Oh, this is one of my first really like flowy shirts. This was from, oh Jesus, don't fall on me. This is from Zara and I, Rude. I seriously need to wear this shirt way more often. The print on it is absolutely amazing. And the way it like flows and fills is so nice. Keeping you. This is what I call my date shirt. Mm, I love this though. It's my really chunky one that I got ages ago from H&M, which I still think was too big, but I still love it. Keeping you. I'll keep it my Zara. I'm gonna try on you. This is my one from Pull and Bear. I used to wear this all the time. But when it came to winter, I just found that I never really gravitate towards this anymore. So I think I'm gonna try on this one as well. Oh. Oh no! Oh, oh! For me, I always have to roll up the sleeve, and I just think, like, as soon as you roll up the sleeve, it makes it look decent. No, I'm not into this anymore. I used to love this, but I just feel like now it looks like something that your grandma would knit for you, and I'm not into that vibe. Bye! I'm gonna ignore suits for the moment. My prom's. I wanna try on this. I saw someone who wore this really nicely, and I'm like, you know what? I wanna retry this piece again. Because, you know what? It could be really trendy this season, and I just could potentially have a trend piece from like a couple of years ago. Obviously, like, Let's ignore the fact that these are two different wives. Oh yeah, no, I'm keeping this. I remember I wanted to throw this away. I was like, keep it for the summer. And now I'm, like, I'm keeping it for the summer. When you roll it up, it looks so cool. It's quite nice because it's like bomber jackets have kind of gone out of style. I mean, they're not out of style, but they're not as popular as they were. I really, really like this. I just think it looks really cool and modern. And I really like it. And I like the white color a lot. I really, really like this a lot. I think the rest I'm gonna keep, actually. This is like the only piece left. I just need to see how big it is on me because I love the style, but it's massive. I really like it. And my dad used to have this, so. Aww. Oh, bird, we're here. I can't. Ah, ha, ha. See, looking at it like, from here, like, if I just did this, I would keep this instantly because it looks nice. I don't think it's like the worst piece ever. Like, I think it's really nice. But my only thing is that this jump is really big and it makes it look like it's fit. This makes me look like I'm swallowed in it and I hate it for that. That's my only problem. I have no clue. I might need to try this one with a different t shirt. Loud look. Like, look how much it looks like it's like swallowing. People will probably be like, it's not. I don't know. Like, from afar, I guess it doesn't. But if you look, look how much gap. I could literally make wings out of this. I kid you not. Uh, I just feel like I look so childish in it. And I mean, I love it. I might have to customize it if I'm that desperate to keep it. Maybe I'll like decrease the sleeve size. DIY this, just make it split a lot better and tailor it more to put my body. This is the top bit done. Next, we're gonna go on to jumpers, which are on the floor. The first one are winter jumpers, and I'm gonna keep all of these because I love these. These all so much. Next, from my autumn, but actually, I think autumn is like, I'm definitely keeping this one. I'm gonna try this one off. This is such an old piece for me. Oh my god. I'm already saying no to this. I mean, I used to wear this all the time, and now I'm just like, this is so boring. I mean, at least there's some like silky bits I like to touch. Also, I remember I cropped it, but I cropped the length. You can see, I think it was supposed to end like that. And I cropped it to like here. I remember Theo, my love, who I love on his Instagram and his new style is wicked, but his old style, he used to wear like a lot of sweatshirts like this. And I used to crop them, so they were always like this length, so I did the same. I'm not in love with this anymore. I'm really not in love with this, so this is definitely going. I love this so much, my midnight one. I don't really want to try this one on because I haven't worn it in a long time, and I just forgot how it fits, so I'm trying that one on. Mm, I don't know. I, I love the embroidery here. I love it, and I love how it fits around the arms because it's really flattering, but I don't know. I think it's really boring, and in my opinion, I can find way better now. The good thing is it fits me like really nicely. The length is pretty good as well. I just don't know. Like I'm a bit uh, up in the eyes up there. I mean, do you think I should keep this or throw this away actually? No, I'm so mixed on this. My sister would kill me if I go this way, but I don't know. I just think it's a bit boring. And then from my spring jumpers, I'm keeping all of them. Now, final round. I mean, I kind of want to try this on because I haven't like, worn this in such a long time and I kind of am curious about the fit. But I feel like most of my t-shirts down here I kind of want to keep. I mean, I feel like this is quite like conceptual and 
Tumblr. I don't know, minimalism? I don't mind it. I just, for me, I just don't wear it because I don't know how to like style it. But honestly, it's not that bad. I don't mind it. I don't think it's kind of cool actually. Oh my god, yay, I'm keeping pieces. This is actually quite nice. I, I quite like this. I can imagine this with like pink smart trousers. I can imagine this with my, I feel like this and my dungarees would look pretty killer. I feel like this and my checkered trousers look really, really cool. Oh my god, I actually quite like this again. Oh my god, I fell in love with this piece again. My heartbreaker one, but I like it because it's a conversation star and it's really cute. But I'll try this on just in case. Oh my god, I actually forgot how much I love this. The only thing is the bat wing see, but why was I thinking it's a lot bigger? It actually fits really nicely and it's like very tongue in cheek because a heartbreaker and I'm not really a heartbreaker. But I really, really like this actually. God damn it, I don't wear this enough. Why, why am I thinking this is really, really big for me? Sorry. Uh, really not that big and I like it. I think the only thing is the bat wing see, but I can deal with that. This is a nice piece. Oh yeah, I'm keeping this. I'm keeping this. We are finally done and we have played out my wardrobe and I realized I'm actually getting rid of quite a lot. That's for Steph. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Your two questions they are. One, would you want to see this again? And number two, what would you want me to declare for next? It could be clothing. It could be my highlight collection. Please don't say that. I have the little highlights. I need more. Or my nail varnish collection or my general room. I just want you to comment down below and see what you want to see. So I do hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, share. You know what to do and I'll see you guys very soon. Cheers! Adios! Goodbye!